everybody, Hidden Object Guru here, back with more Haunted Hotel. Is this the time we defeat the Haunted Hotel and the evil guy who made a, a time vortex and a weather machine? Uh, I hope so. Yeah, yeah, no, I know. Okay, I was worried when it did that uh, talking sequence again, it was going to make me do all of the... Uh, the rooms again, but obviously that's not that. Oh, wait a minute, it is. Hold on. Oh no. It says spring nine, but it is locked over and it should spray sp <laughs> say spring zero. It's just a glitch. It hasn't forced me to do that again, or, you know, sectioned off my ability to do that. Bonus item! Oh, crap. Alright. No. Damn it. Come on. Oh, come on. Wait, wait, I think I got this. I hate cat's cradles so much. <laughs> I was never good at them as a child, and I hate virtual ones as an adult. Uh, let's just do this thing. Alright, so it's a snail army helmet. Wrench lion boot. Sadly, you're not a lion. Ladybug barrel noose. Noose! That's a big ladybug. Barrel, boot, head. Lion! I actually found that lion before. I don't know why I forgot him immediately. Uh, snail army helmet. Oh. Why do I think the snail is going to be trouble? Because snails are tiny? God, some of the things I've been picking up in this game... I cannot imagine finding them on the original monitor size this game was intended for, or even playing it not zoomed into my whole screen, just native resolution uh, in a window, because, like, that, that roll of film that was halfway off the screen to the left, how would you ever find that thing? Uh, wooden stamp. What is a wooden stamp? Oh. It's a random click that worked out pretty well for me. Oh, okay. I call those rubber stamps. Maybe that's just me. Uh, okay, where are we? Uh, flashlight? No. Coin, thermometer. Lots of thermometers in this place. Oh, because he's making weather rooms. That actually makes perfect sense. I was about to criticize something I didn't understand. No, it's a ruler, not a thermometer. And telephone is an extra minute, so let's grab that. I keep forgetting to grab the uh, extra time, which might come back to bite me later. Key? There's the roll of film that would have been completely invisible. We're not playing this, you know, on a really way too big uh, screen. Voltimeter? What does a voltimeter look like? That's what it looks like. Huh. Bullets. Ah. Hanger. Right there. Cassette coffee cup coin thermometer. I keep expecting the thermometer to be hanging on a wall. But obviously that's a very naive thing to think in this game. Uh... Is it weird that the the border on the wallpaper there is coming through the sign? I thought those might have been coins. Oh no, wait, it says coins. It's probably that stack of coins again that we found in the other screen. Although I'm having no luck seeing it. Uh, there's the mouse or rat or another kitten. Uh, cassette coffee cup coin thermometer. All right, so we're probably gonna give up on this and head to another room soon. Cause I'm just not seeing this stuff. Don't think a coffee cup would be this difficult to find, do you? But, uh, oh! I don't know why, but in my head I differentiate between cups and mugs, and I shouldn't, especially when you're dealing with hidden object games who have a, uh, shall we say, a loose definition of what words mean. Uh -huh. That's cable. There's a voice recorder. Hippo. And a shelf. No. Cassette. Uh, coin and thermometer. Oh, it's not coins. It's coin. Damn. Well, I was getting into trouble then. Is it sitting in the lens of something? Is that it? No. That was pretty silly. All right, back to the map. We only have ten items left, people. This is doable. Globe. Seashell. Teaspoon. I remember the teaspoon. There it is. Beer. Is that... No, that's a wine bottle. Um, same one bottle from the other room. Yeah, they love reusing objects in this game. If 
there's one thing I'm going to associate with this game. It's reusing the same objects over and over and over and over and over again. I may not have said enough overs there. That's how often they reuse objects. Transparent snake, but it's not the cobra I need to find. Seriously, though, the transparent snake is not cool, guys. Beer apple horseshoe doll. Beer apple horseshoe doll. The doll was holding a doll for some weird inception doll nonsense. And the fog is just... That's just crap, guys. That's... You're, you're cheating me. Uh, okay. Hmm. Oh, cassette. And that's the beer. Uh, apple cobra. The least delicious kind of cobra. That's right. Not that fond of apples. See, I could have done the joke with the least delicious kind of, uh... Of apple... But then I would have had to have said Cobra Apple, so I kind of locked myself into that. Uh, I'm just not seeing it. And obviously someone is sneaking up on me, hence that sound. So let's uh, head back to another room. Uh, spy room. I know, detective room. Alright, so detective room is face and two cigars. And I only need two items, people. Uh... Okay, it's sad that I didn't find any of the cigars. Sorry, either of the cigars. Any would only be if it was more than two. English is such a complicated language. Um, no, that's a feather. Uh, that's a lapel pin. Is that the pin from years ago? Years ago? Last night. Okay, now you're just taunting me. Uh, yeah, let's take a hint. Oh, you jerk. Oh, yeah, I don't have an excuse for not finding that one. And, uh... Is that a no, it's not a cigar. And now, apparently, he decided to smoke the cigar and he started coughing. Hint. Wow. Damn, though. I understand why I didn't find that. And we did both of our uh, puzzle things, so we're good to go. Alright. Floor 10... So we're 10% of the way through the game. Uh, Saw it peered through the window and seemed like the summer sun was beating down on my weary body. The air in the room perhaps it made it difficult to breathe. Shaman, I think, I understand the entire system. They use the artifacts the captain brought into the shaman's room. Somehow the shaman makes it work by receiving something from all. Okay. Uh, one for each season. Then this infernal machine starts to work and something begins to happen to our world. Apparently they also need people for creative ones. Oh! Oh, man. Victim's place in special rooms. Okay. So he's sucking the life out of creative people to make it work. Uh, scientist shame the captain using the hotel's guests as fuel suddenly had a very unpleasant thought. Are we creative, though? I'm trying to warn off the evil. I see when we start to swoon. I clearly couldn't take the heat anymore. I have to take my chance in the hallway. Oh, the fog. Nice. Let's do this. Okay. We all see this, right? 49 items. We're only allowed uh, to miss one in five rooms. Luckily, we got our five hints back. But I'm not going to bring any items because I want more hints if I need them. Uh, electric fan, as always. Flower pot. Um, it's a little early for me to be failing. Thermometer or thermometer, if you prefer. What's that? No one prefers that? Is that not a thermometer? Huh. Alright, uh, we'll come back to... No, we won't come back to that. It's right there. Padlock. I remember the padlock was over here somewhere. Yep, there it is. Basically invisible. Handprints. Handprints. Hanger. Uh, keys. If I were a set of keys, I would be right there. Turtle. Hey, little buddy. Bat and handheld fan. Uh, okay. Don't see the bat. That's the handheld fan, so I'm just going to... Oh, wait, it might be a baseball bat. That No, that's a hammer. There it is. All right, so you may notice I can get the handheld fan now, but I'm choosing not to. I keep waving my mouse in f the mouse cursor in front of things, even though it doesn't show up in the recording. I had to get out of that habit. I'm too used to using the other recorder, which didn't work on this game. Long story short, that's why you can't see the uh, thing. Hey, new screen! And so the point is, the reason I'm not getting it is... With this 50 items, I figure there's a chance I might need to come back and get more hints. So, why not just uh, leave the room open for now? Chili pepper. Two anvils. That is 
That is like one more anvil than I see you needing in just like a house. Or even a motel. You know? Teddy bear. This game really loves its teddy bears. Oh, hey, it's a bonus item. Might as well do it now. Oh, crap. This is actually the easiest one I've been asked to do. <laughs> All right, I uh, I will now stop complaining about those uh, matches. I was about to ask matches what because that's how slow I am. This one is weirdly underpopulated compared to the other screens. See what I mean? Like it's less cluttery. Is that a hat? Looked like a hat to me. Under the fire extinguisher, I mean. Um, there's the chest set again. Oh, there we go. No, I didn't leave one open. Damn it! How did I immediately forget to do that? Oh, whatever. Let's just uh, finish the rest of them. Writer? Oh, that's a new room. Oh, no. No, it's not. We've, have we been here? Anyway, not important. Uh, no, we've been here. I remember that rose. Metal star. Yep. Hand. Like a, like a human hand? It's a weird thing to ask for. You don't mean like a hand print? Oh, I found a bonus item. Nice. Salvation. Wow, the words are getting a little longer. game isn't getting a lot harder, though, which I really appreciate. Yay! Perfection! Yes! Uh, just three more letters, and they came right to me. Although, apparently, I accidentally re-picked up a T when I already had the T. Doesn't matter to me, though. Hey, let's hope the next item we pick up isn't a, uh isn't, uh, well, no, Jigsaw Puzzle will be fine. Oh, there it was, a handprint. Coffee Mill. Such a popular thing in games. I want to do a list of all the times I, uh, have had to grind things up in coffee mills in games, but, uh, I started noticing it before I was the hidden object guru, and I didn't write down any of the times it happened, and the games I've covered as the hidden object guru have been weirdly short on that particular dynamic. Uh, propeller, or prop. I've seen you in a bunch of screens. There you are. Cork. That's exactly where it was last time, and the two keys I remember are next to each other. Damn it, why do I keep finishing screens? Although, you know, they're not actually that complicated, but still, like, remember, leave some space for some to collect some extra time this time. Handprint. See, that's what you call it. You call it a hand print, not a hand. Prize. We may not be doing this one in order because the prize is not jumping out at me. Is that a prize? Really swore that was a prize. The thing with the globe in it that doesn't serve any purpose next to the picture frame and the chest set. Again, this would be so much easier if I just had the pointer. Uh, candles, radio, candles. So you mean probably mean candelabra when you say candles, and you did. And radio. Well, you didn't mean candelabra, you just mean two candlesticks. Huh. Uh, teapot, pig, a guitar. Pig, a guitar. Where's the metal? There's the metal. There's a paintbrush on top of it, which I'm not supposed to pick up. Uh, prize, moon, beer, teapot. There's the teapot. I thought I saw the moon, but it immediately swept out of my uh, field of vision, so... Maybe I was crazy. And nobody sees a fluttering thing, so we can get that second puzzle out of the way? Yeah, me neither. Uh, Alright, is this an award? That was an award. And that's the beer. So I was going to leave one space open anyway, but this time it's a space I legit can't find. It's right there. It's a full moon. I don't... <laughs> it was right on top of the column. I don't know why it didn't occur to me that it could have been a full moon, but it was. Dagger. Nice. Uh, bowling pin. Bowling pin? Yep. Iron. Scissors. Gear here is the bonus item, which I, you know, just want a little more time. Just to be safe. No scissors, you're always asking me for scissors, but this time they're easy to find, unlike the usual. Umbrella, lamp. Uh, hmm. Is the lamp folded? Because I'm not seeing it. Sorry, is the umbrella folded? Because I'm not seeing one. Uh, hmm, lamp should be more obvious than it is. Alright, hanger is where it always is. No, that's a boomerang. The hanger was up here. Uh, vegetables, that's a weird thing to offer, but there they are. Police hat. Oh, always a police hat, guys. So I found the police hat once as a... Um, oh, it's a thing. Shackles are down here in case I need them. I found the police hat 
twice as an item and then once as just a uh there's a meat grinder as a bonus item so yeah i'm pretty well acquainted with where they hide that uh that police hat there's two watering cans in this level that's slightly weird uh dagger iron umbrella dagger iron umbrella so dagger uh as you know is a knife with a hilt that's what differentiates and uh, not with a hilt with a, a flared out sword guard type of thing and that's what differentiate differentiates a knife from a uh, sword or dagger and that's why uh, uh jason Voorhees in the movie uh freddy versus jason it was upside down is not using a machete in the film he's using a sword uh, because it has a sword guard yeah a finger protector along between the pommel and the blade. And uh, I know that's a, a really minor distinction, but it is a distinction. You know, I only need two items, and I know where the two items are, so why am I frustrating myself looking for this iron? Um, what was I saying? Yes, uh, on the subject of Jason. There's the moon. Yeah. And a machete, while scary, nobody's saying machetes aren't scary, is just a big knife. No, that's not what I meant to do. Summer! Uh, what was I looking for? Handheld fan, which was right there. Done and done! That's, uh, that's another victory under the notched belt thing. Oh, energy. The silliest one of them all. Although also the fastest to do, so... Oh, I guess... Uh, if I don't screw it up like a dope, Simon is actually faster. Oh, come on. I'm screwing this up. Pretty hardcore. My hand is all twitchy. There we go. Oof, so silly. Got it done, though. I don't know why it gives me the hit, like, the percentage of the total that I got. Doesn't it cut off after I collect the 30? Like, I couldn't possibly get the 75, could I? 80, 72, of course! But that means the next one has to be 9081. Okay, alcohol bottles and books, center of the pair of glasses, abandoned on the floor and books, paper and pens covered in desks. Covered the desk, ugh. Writer had been here. Hey, the writer's room. Expected, I tore the page from the book. Are you sure, like, might be in another world. Window I stand within another. Okay. Okay. Survive to see them. Yikes! This flight into eternity. Am I the chosen one who's been punished for all the bad things I've done? Wow. Uh, there's screams and pairs. Do, 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 do. Wow. Flying into the darkness unknown. Yikes. Cold mist 2. Fallen other people join me in its depths. Then how did you write this? Oh, I see. It's a... It's a time loop thing. Gotcha. Another terrible fate to conform my suspicions. The evil plan the scientist and his cohorts were carrying this place. Somehow this place is used to travel through time. Duh. Consumed by their own creation. I hope. Trapped on a sinking ship. Damn, though. 53 items. Wow. Although, out of a possible of 64. So they're giving me a whole one item. Uh. To, uh. Now figure out one way or the other. All right, hamburger. Oh, I meant to do them in order. That's not a wooden box. You know, a chest is technically a wooden box, everybody. In case you're wondering. Chest is technically a wooden box. Uh, let's not try to do this in order, then. I'm just going to get angry if I do. Um, is that it back there? No. Okay, carjack. Um, I assume it's the accordion kind, not the part with a stand-up. Yep, accordion kind. Apple. Brush. Apple. Let's see a brush, but we'll come back to that. Uh, road cone camera, five hats. Wow. Road cones are usually so easy to find because they're orange. There it is. Uh, camera. Yep. Five hats. Let's do this. One, two, two, three. I don't like waiting for the next item. Five. Hey, it's um the 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 game of Simon. So they are differently labeled. E four, five, 
six. Two, three, four, five, six. Once these get up to like nine, I'm gonna start screwing them up a lot. Bonus item is a compass. The geometry compass, not the other kind. Keys! And I'm saving the car for later. It's right there, at the bottom of the screen. A uh, hamburger brush. Is this not the hamburger? Oh no, I just clicked on something else first, so I didn't get to pick it up. Uh, brush! Maybe if I yell brush louder, it'll just appear? I'm kidding. When did I find the wooden box? Now I'm puzzled. Uh, you know what? Let's not worry about it. We'll come back to this room if we need to. Hopefully we will not need to. Although, I think we might be nearing the end of the game, because they literally can't have any more than six rooms. Well, no, I guess they could put a seventh one at the end. But I feel like that would be the most number of rooms they could do. Uh, so, elephant. Art doll. Oh, yeah, that's an art doll. Clothespin. I'm skipping you, because clothespins tend to be hard to find. Wrench. Uh, he's right there. See? That was a smart thing to skip. Shoes. Die. Now you're calling it a die. Oh my god, what are you doing to me, game? You're confusing me with your nonsense. Clothes hanger. Lion head right there. Wow, that was not a challenge. Let's uh, get a little more time just to be safe. Now let's map it before we come back to look for the clothespin, which we might not actually have to do, because, well, you know. A lot of people breaking glass. Uh, and the... Oh, no, it's right there. It's the springy kind. All right, do you want to hear the embarrassing thing that just happened to me? In my head, I was thinking safety pin, and that's why I didn't see the clothespin. Saw! But what kind of saw? Stars. I think this screen is new. I don't think we've been here before. Stars are twinkling in from the ceiling there? No, they are not. That would have been clever, though. Cheese ore. Uh, I don't even know ore. Ugh. God. These attempts at comedy get worse every second. Uh, cheese envelope. Oh, there's the envelope. Still no cheese. You'd think the rat would tip me off have tip me off as to its location. It's that kind of saw. It was that kind of saw. Uh, phone, clock, top, cheese. I think that wrap that keeps chittering would uh, tip me off, but it's it's been of no use. The rat. Um, what the hell is that thing? That's a sharpener. These are the stars. There should have been more obvious to me than they were. Uh, phone. Here, phone, 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 phone. No, that is not a phone. Um, hmm. There's a starfish. Couldn't be further from what I'm looking for. There's the top. Phone clock, top cheese. So phone clock, cheese. Still no sign of the phone. The clock is right there. That was the most embarrassing thing that's happened to me in this game. And this game is the cheese is huge. How was I missing the cheese? The cheese was like two percent of the screen. Which doesn't sound like a lot, but actually is, when you consider the size of the screen I'm looking at. Uh, anything else? Phone. Oh, it was yellow. The phone was yellow. I was assuming a black phone, or maybe a white or gray portable phone. Yellow was literally the last thing that occurred to me. Hey, we're back in the basement. Alright, so it's accordion. God, I love the accordion. I grab that thing a lot. Two helmets. That's one. That's a helmet. Apparently, it doesn't count that as a helmet. It counts uh, a safety helmet as a helmet, but not a policeman's helmet. It's not a hat, guys. It's reinforced. Uh, goblet. Books. Goblet. Did I get the goblet last time, or did I get the goblet in a different room? I feel like it might have been a different room. So let's get the stack of books and come back to goblet. Circle back around, as the kids say. Flower pot. The letter N. Because apparently... Oh! Come on, that would have been so clever. How is that not right? It's the letter N. Game, you're cheating me. This is what cheating looks like. Two keys. One. There's the goblet. I don't know why finding a key immediately led me to the goblet. But it's, oh, the letter N is just sitting there. Oh, that is... That is not making me look good. Uh, map stamp. Well, the map should be easy to find. Because, you know, it has to look like a map. And we all know what maps look like. Hey, there's uh, eyeballs back there. Nice. There we go. And uh, a key and a stamp. So I'm going to say this is the stamp. Got no line on the key. 
but we're going to circle back around if we have to. Uh, 17 minutes to get through two more rooms, people. Hey, the engineer's room again. Uh, that's the bicycle I had so much trouble finding. Or did I find that one easily? That's ah, not important. Three sets of pliers. It's weird that uh, when I was so frustrated looking for scissors here last time, I almost yelled about how annoying it was that there were all these pliers right there, but no scissors anywhere. And it turned out the scissors were, were pretty obvious to find as well. But uh, at the time, it, but the frustration felt, re felt real. Valve. Um, you sure you don't mean a valve handle? You meant a valve handle, as you often do. Video games. Uh, there's a wrench, shell, fork. I need a shell and I need a fork. Oh, there's the shell. Uh, fork and camera. Please, camera. Not asking for a lot. I got bioculars. I got a pocket watch. I got whatever that... Oh, it's a one-way sign. Uh, camera, fork. Oh, there's the camera. I guess it was a film camera? Alright, and fork is... Uh, yeah, not seeing it. Just not seeing a fork. Well, we'll come back if we have to, but odds are this will be the... Well, you know what? If there's any we could end up skipping. Because, fingers crossed, we're going to have enough time... Bridal is what that one's called. Uh, we're probably going to have enough to uh, hints left, as long as we don't like to do that uh, thing where we have to find multiple items to get one... Like... Because when I click on hint, it doesn't tell me where all the stars are. It tells me where a star is, and it's very frustrating. Uh, you don't want to need hearts this time? You need three more stars. That is a lot of stars. It's not a small amount of stars, considering I'm not able to see one. The candle's on fire. I do like that. Uh, book, lion. Oh, the lion. I love the lion. Uh, teapot, book. That's a book. Beer, umbrella. The beer is always looks exactly the same, so... There's a couple of different umbrellas, but the beer always looks the same. Teapot. Uh, okay. I feel like this is the room we're going to be stipping, skipping with its three stars. Is that a teapot? It is! Right, so let's take a, a brief look for stars. Uh, that lady has hearts over her nipples, so that's not stars. Lots of hearts in this screen that I could easily find if I had to, but uh, that box of candy hearts has another heart on it, so... Uh, what was I doing? Stars. I'm just at a loss. Oh, wait, there was this one. Two. Oh, come on. Am I, am I going to do this? After all that whining and complaining about stars, am I actually going to get all the stars? Uh, yes, I am. Wow. Would you look at that? All right, let's finish this up. Uh, I need three items. There are four items left, and I have more than enough hints for all of them, so let's just go wrap this up. Uh, as usual, I'm going to give myself 10 seconds to find the thing, and then I'm going to just collect it. Okay. Thought it would be the food with the food, but it's not with the food, so I'm sure it's hiding on some vertical or her... It was that kind of fork. I guess I just... If you don't have three or four tines, I don't think of you as a fork. I think of you as like some kind of a torture-poking implement. Uh, key... Are you vertically or horizontally in one of these pipes? Because that would be smart. Are you hanging off? Oh, you were hanging off the moped. And now that I say that, I'm pretty sure I had to find the key last time. One item left, people. Are we going to the writer's room or the stock room? Let's go stock room. Uh, brush. Oh, right. The brush angered me the most. You know what? We're not going to do the stock room. I'm going to give it a quick sweep. Uh, yeah, nothing. I got nothing. So if you were able to find the brush, more power to you, because we're never going to... I'm never going to know where it was. Unless I come back here for uh, another level. Because I always knew where the clothespin was. <laughs> done and done! I will click anywhere to continue. Thank you. Oh, I didn't do either of the things. Apparatus. I must have used some sort of apparatus. Uh, they would have had some sort of apparatus, is the is the line I'm quoting now. And if you can tell me what that uh, must have had some sort of apparatus uh, line is a reference to, and be the first commenter to do so under this video, you will win a Hidden Object Game-related prize. I'll be honest with you, it's just going to be a copy of a Hidden Object Game, so don't get too excited, but, you know, 
you're obviously here because, like me, you like hidden object games, so as gifts go, I I think it's okay. Jigsaw puzzle! Please no, don't be any bigger. You're not! Oh, you're my hero. Uh, hmm. Oh, I see. You're, uh, there. Alright, uh, there's the dog. Or no, that's a cat, sorry. Um, there's another cat. Lots of cats running around this place. Uh, which is something that always makes me happy about, uh, houses. I can't have cats myself, you see, due to allergies. Uh, or as allergies are known, the devil's candy. Uh, hmm. Yeah, it was. Uh, okay, that's this right here. Uh, okay, that's obviously a chandelier. I gotta say, uh, and I think this is true, this is something that will be acknowledged as universally true. When they tell you what the jigsaw puzzle is kind of, is supposed to look like with an overlay, so you can just slide the picture over where it's supposed to go, it is considerably easier to do jigsaw puzzles. Like, some might say ridiculously easier. Ridiculously easier. Uh, okay. Huh. There we go. Alright. Uh, kitty cat! There's like four cats in this room. Way to go, guys. Taking over the house. And more power to you. Boom. Done. Didn't even have to rotate those ones. Haven't had to rotate anything in a while, actually. Did this game not need rotation? Well, okay, finally I needed to rotate again, but... It was a while. Alright, we're good! That's it? Alright, let's uh, find out what's next. Floor 12. You know what, it just occurred to me there might be 13 floors, because, you know, games. Uh, way to the opposite end of the corridor. So, I feel like when they were writing these documents, they thought the floor, the hotel was going to have less floors than the game does. Also, there are three floors in that hotel. Uh, breeze in. The gale turned fog. This one smelled of oak and had natural leaves dancing in its gentle gusts. Huh. Uh, there are the engineer's seasonal rooms. Uh, fog was out there. Autumn breeze ended. Candles. I went to a priest's room and somehow... Bad omen. Hesitantly, I began looking around the room. Was the cinder rifle where priests belong? Is are we finally going to see the priest's room? We are! Unless you've already been here. Oh, screw you, game. Um, yeah, I know I haven't been having that hard a time with this. But just two middle fingers aimed at this game. This is such crap. Uh, not letting me see what I'm looking for. You're reminding me of the way that uh, otherwise wonderful game... Uh, what's it called? Um, Campfire Legends 3, The Last Act, ruined its otherwise beautiful... Uh, there we go, there's the hat. Uh, nest. Is that a nest? That was not a nest. Looking for some sort of a nesty type substance with nestular qualities. There we go. Pumpkin! Oh, the cat! I found the cat. He's right here. Abacus, gun, yeah, like, um, the second Campfire Legends game did a fantastic job because you play the whole game and you go through in a regular narrative function without ever having to do a list, but then it unlocks every puzzle in the game to do timed, list on, to, timed lists on to challenge yourself. So, yeah, many reasons why it's, uh, nice. I was clicking on the cannon, but I accidentally hit that. Evil clown, everybody! There's an evil clown. With, like, a mallet that he's ready to club you with. That's weirdly creepy and uh, effective. Alright, uh, let's hope we never have to go back to the priest's room. Ace! Uh, light bulb? No, that's seashell. I often think light bulbs are seashells, don't I? Uh, yeah. It's, uh, why that is the best hidden object game, along, of course, with, uh, two guns. One, and... I'll come back to... Oh, no, there it is. Uh, light bulb, saber, yep. Dice. There they are. Anchor, bell, seashell, alarm clock. Anchor, bell, seashell, alarm clock. 
Uh, anchor, bell, seashell, alarm clock. Thought that was a bell. I was wrong. Uh, okay. There's the seashell. That is totally a seashell. What are you doing to me? Well, I guess this is also a seashell. That's a snail. What am I saying? Um, yes. Infected the Twin Vaccine is the other best hidden object game. Just FYI. Oh, nice. Uh, light bulb, fish, bell. There's the fish. Never did find that light bulb, did I? There you are. Uh, is that the bell? No. I got nothing on this bell. Oh. What if it's a hand bell? Then it could just look like a... You know, a shape. There's the ace. You know, we're going to sit on the bell for now. We're going to leave it. We're going to come back if we need to. I hope we don't. But we might have to. One last scan. Oh, there it is. It's Invisibel. See what I did there? Invisibel. I wonder if that's going to be uh, the invisible girl in... Uh, uh, the... Uh, wow, The Incredibles. That's going to be her uh, superhero name, Invisibel. I feel like that would work. There's a decent uh, hit uh, superheroine name. Old Phone. Yeah, they've all been old phones, guys. Snake? Oh, I remember the snake. Remember I found him somewhere and then I'm like, oh, why can't I click on the snake? You're frustrating me. He's basically invisible, is why. The skull. The skull's the thing I never found. You make me so angry, Skull. Um, not going to have any more. You know what? This time, since we get our second shot out of it later when I'm coming back and angry and just trying to wrap this thing up, we're going to use a hidden object uh, hint to just find the skull. All right, so popcorn saw. There's popcorn. Where's the saw? Saw. Scroll. Hourglass has a pretty distinctive figure. It shouldn't be that hard to find, but it is. Grass? How am I missing grass? Uh, first off, that is a picture of grass, so I don't know what you guys are looking for. Uh, seashell, no. I got, I got nothing. Where are you, hourglass? I feel like, are those candelabras for, like, tea lights? Yeah, probably not. Uh, oh, tea lights. You're so useful. And I almost never use you for keeping uh, tea warm in a uh, teapot. And by almost never, I mean just never. I don't know why I tried to qualify that. I've never once... To, well, I mean, I've never once done it for myself. I've lit them for other people to keep their uh, tea warm. That's how I first found out about tea lights. And now you can just buy them en masse at Ikea, because people... Uh, and that's grass. That was grass. It was a picture of grass. Because uh, people don't use them for uh, tea anymore. They're just a very conveniently sized decoration. And that is the story of tea lights that I felt to need to tell you for some reason. Screw you, game. Oh, if there are no... Oh my god, what if it keeps giving me harder and harder levels and eventually all of them have this darkness nonsense? That would be unsettling. No, that's a chisel, not a knife. Um, two umbrellas. Okay, well, how hard can an umbrella be to find? Pretty GD hard when the lights are off. Okay, I guess not that hard. Glasses, knife, alarm clock, gift, alarm clock, gift? Ah, oh, there it is. Five hats. Oh, we did the five hats before, didn't we? So it was policeman's hat, fedora-looking thing, lady's hat, something other hat, uh, and then baseball cap. Where's the other hat? Oh, you were on top of the basketball. All right, uh, see you later, knife. Uh, I may or may not be back. And I'm not going to bother looking for the bonus item because that place is horrible. Stairs! We just did the stairs, so I was excited to go back. Uh, two anvils. Remember, this is the one that seemed like it was weirdly underpopulated compared to the other screens. Rifle. Matches. To the point where, like, half of these are stuff I discovered last time. That's a slight exaggeration, and I mean slight. Butterfly. Judge Hammer. You know, you knew to call it a gavel the last time it appeared. Like, changing the name of what you call it is just strange. Saxophone is the bonus item. That makes me weirdly happy. Uh, hammer nut shackle. Hammer nut shackle. There's the shackle. There's the nut. That's right, an acorn is apparently terribly and technically a nut now. Uh, hammer. Uh, there's a dagger. There's a hatchet. I'm seeing a hammer. You know what? We'll circle around and uh, come back if we need it. I'm going to take an extra minute now, and then I you know I can grab the Buddha if I need another extra minute. Travelers! 
Oh, that's where the Jason room is. Travelers. All right, it's 13 hidden items we still need to get. Oh my golly. Uh, pocket watch. Huh, there we go. Rubik's cube. Is it Rubik's? Oh, there was a Rubik's cube. Binoculars, I remember that. Had a devil of time finding them last time, but I got them this time. Uh, there's one eye, two eyes, and hopefully the third eye will show up right now. It did. Horseshoe. Hey, look, it's the um, game of match three. Might as well do it. No, it's Unravel. Oh. Okay, so you have to be here. I feel like you have to cross this way. Um, no. Huh. Oh, I see. You go all the way to the other side. Yay! So I've learned that the secret there is looking which go over and which go under. And that's that's how you figure out what to do. In case you're wondering what the secret is, now that I've kind of figured it out, uh, that's, that's the secret. Although, I guess that was probably common knowledge and I was just making it difficult for myself all this time. In which case, I apologize. The star is a star of David, uh, because it doesn't have the little circles on the end that would make it a sheriff's star. Okay, um, just FYI, if you're sitting in a recliner, having it suddenly recline out from under you is a very terrifying experience. I didn't yelp there, but I wanted to yelp. Alright, can you please tell me where the skull is hint thing? I'm going to take one last quick peek for the hourglass, and then I'm just going to hint my way to the skull. Yeah, it turns out in... Um, that terrible Civil War game that nearly broke me. Uh, you didn't need to... Uh, anything else? No? Alright, I'm just going to give up. Uh, you actually could get more hints? Damn, though. Alright, tell me where the skull is. That is a really well-hidden skull, guys. Like, really well-hidden. Uh, yeah, you didn't need to go nuts. There was actually a way to... Stock room, you need the light, don't you? Stairs, you don't need the light. Priest, you need the light. So I'm going to go to the one where you don't need the light. Um, yes, there was a way to get more hints by playing Minesweeper, and I didn't read the instructions close enough, closely enough. So yeah, the Civil War game was not as, uh, as frustrating as it needed to be. Uh, sorry, did not to be need to be as frustrating as it was. Said that backwards. Uh, yeah, I, just because I didn't pay close enough attention to the instructions. Uh, so let's take ten seconds, try to find the hammer, and then just uh, cheat our way to the end of this level. Um, Alright, cheating our way. Oh! Wow, that fog really blended the, uh, the wood of the hammer in with the wood of the stairs. We still need to do two more? Didn't we just do one? My god, this game really is going to be 83 levels, isn't it? We're going to be here for a week. Honestly, uh, if if it turns out that there's like six more levels in this game, I might take a break for a couple of days and play a different hidden object game, just because this is... I mean, I'm not saying it's sapping my will to live or making me hate hidden object games. I'm not going to be overly dramatic about this, but it is pretty terrible. Nice! Let's get the energy, yeah, because I feel like at some point it's going to make us get all six of the puzzles in one. The game is like, I hope you enjoy doing the same puzzles over and over again, because boy do we have the same puzzles over and over again for you to do. Yeah. Wow. Oh, I see what it means. Total energy that flew while I was playing it. That's why it's giving me percentage. So theoretically, I mean, I don't know that this is actually possible, but I guess you could get all of them and actually get 100% and finish it in like five seconds. Are there 20 stories in this hotel? Okay, the fog. It's the wall certain this would be doom. Did he already do this? Cat was mewling at my feet. Station leaping through the tra tail of the fog that was pouring into the room. I was covered with frost when I came out the other side and frost bitten everywhere. 
cat for guidance, but it mute again. I knew that I was absolutely getting inside. I backed up across the door and took a running start. Okay, well, doing a lot of that. Oh my Christ. Six rooms, we have to find 11 in each. Although, I think if we get many more items, like if we get close to 20 items, which I don't want to, but the, seeing the way this game is going, we might. Uh, we're going to be at a point where I'm just picking up everything in the room. Like, we're actually getting close to that now. Okay, video camera. Drum. Don't remember where the acorn is, but that's it right there. No, it's not. Really thought that was the acorn. Uh, gramophone. How can a gramophone hide from me? Like, my entire thing in hidden object games is spotting gramophones. That's basically all I do. It didn't have the big horn. That's how it was hiding from me. A cup. You often mean mug. Yep, you meant mug that time too. A rose. Yep, a weight. So that could be a barbell. That could be a... Uh, what's the other kind? Uh, could be ones you use for scales. The weight is not something that immediately says, oh, well, obviously this is me. Uh, okay. Teddy bear toast. All right, we can come back for the acorn and the weight later if we need to. Uh, for right now, I'm going to head off to the next room. We're only getting one extra item, aren't we? All right, let's do one of the puzzles now. Okay, um, this one looks like it sucks. So those are under all of this. Wait. Over. Okay. This is over both of these, but... Okay, wait. Hold on. That's both over and under, but if I get it out of the way, we should be fine. Now there's just a question of... There. These are not neat solutions. These are not, you know, clever solutions. But I'm getting out of the levels, and I think that's what counts. Boots! Drum again? Angel? Um, oh, there you are. It's a cherub. Four hats. One. Two. Yeah, I, we definitely did this. Hey, remember when I couldn't find this dinosaur and I thought the kangaroo was the dinosaur? Well, this time, uh, it still looks like a cash box. I actually was looking for the kangaroo. Watering can! Still didn't look like a watering can to me, but I'm not going to complain after I've succeeded. Uh, film. Boots. Leaf. Santa. We already got the Santa hat. Now we actually just need a Santa. Boots. Film. Uh, there's an iron. Remember that time I was stumped by an iron? And I gave up on it? In many ways, I regret doing that. Guys, just covering stuff up with foreground nonsense is kind of crap. Like, you just shouldn't be doing that. Uh, you are going to get me an extra minute. And then we're going to go back to this room, check out the engineer. You know, it's summer. Let's do summer. Two umbrellas. That would be... Uh, hmm. Don't see any umbrellas. You know, circle back around. Paddle. Faucet. Paddle. Uh, faucet is right there. Hanger. Ooh, is this the one level that has a hard hanger? No, it isn't. The hanger, as always, is super easy to find. Camera one. Camera two. Is there a camera three? Somewhere. Uh, teddy bear. Handheld fan. Yep. They just called this one a fan last time. Photos is the blackmail photos there. Hammer ruler. Uh, no. Oh, there's the hammer. The same hammer I missed in the other screen. Is that a ruler that's folded up? It was! I always uh, never trusted folding rulers, because I always worried that I won't be able to get them straight enough, and that's an umbrella. And therefore, it will defeat the entire purpose of using a ruler. Although, I guess the other purpose is uh, having a straight line. It's not just measurement. Uh, although, you can just use any straight edge for having a straight line. Lizard camera. Ugh, oh, lizard cameras. The worst, am I right? Uh, not seeing a lizard or a camera. Although, there's an acorn. If only that was the acorn I needed. Uh, you know what? Again, we can come back later. We're not going to get hung up on this. Autum. Jump chair? What the hell is a jump chair? I don't see any kind of chair. Forget it. You know what? Let's do it. Phone. Uh, gas mask. Finally. Lamp. Right there. That is a lamp. I don't know what you're doing to me. That's also a lamp, but mine was a lamp, too. Shackle. Gear. Right there. I thought that was a saw blade last time. That was silly of me. Um, 
weather vane. Oh, that was not hard at all. Vegetables again. Megaphone. Frog. The frog is, yep, down on the floor where I left him. Still don't know what a jump chair is. Like, is that the thing you use in a plane to eject to safety? Huh. Jump chair phone. Jump chair phone. Is it hiding back? That was a jump chair! Like, I clicked on it, and I still don't know what it was. The dagger is the bonus item. I don't see it, but how hard could it be to find if I need it? We may be back. We may never be back. Artist! Uh, rose. Always a rose. Hey, it's another box! I'm gonna feel like this is match three. Yeah. Well, we had to do it eventually, folks. And, uh, yeah, I hate it. I hate every part of it. There's nothing about this I don't hate. Oh. I almost had an even better one than that. Ah, uh, okay. Really screwed this up, didn't you, Hoguru? And the answer is, yeah, I 100% screwed that up. Then I kept screwing it up. What am I doing? Pay closer attention. Okay. Alright, come on. Bejeweled. Um, in the history of, uh, you know, what do you call that? Doing uh, Let's Plays. I figure, in its own way, um, hidden object games are the best, since by and large, you, the audience, can also look for the hidden objects in a way that, you know, playing a game of... Uh, I'm going to pretend there's a game called Kung Fu Demon for the point of this. Playing a game of Kung Fu Demon, you just get to watch me be bad at Kung Fu or uh, somebody else be good at Kung Fu. Whereas here, we can do this together. I mean, you can't help me unless I'm live streaming, but still, you can also search for the items. By comparison, match three, like, it's an entirely, well, not entirely, but largely luck-based puzzle game. How can that possibly be fun to watch? Like, I'm guessing there is, there is nobody live streaming, uh, it was a picture of a rose, everybody. It was a picture of a rose. Hey, this is where I never found the rat, isn't it? This is the screen where there was a rat that I never could figure out where he was. No, this isn't that one. He's right there. I don't think I would have figured that, uh, fooled with that one in the past. There's lips. Teddy bear. The earth. Iron tin can dice. Bow. And there's the tin can. Remember how much trouble I had finding that tin can? And I'm like... When it lights up, all of the features that make it a tin can disappear. Hey, I actually finished a room. That's new. Uh, pistol. Dominoes. Board. No. Bow. Ooh, that was bad. Uh, three kinds of bows, people. Which one is it? Uh, there's bows. There's bows and arrows. Uh, there's bows you tie, bows and arrows. And then there's the bow that uh, you use to play a violin with. Bow, voltimeter, burger. We found out what the voltimeter looked like, right? It was just a white box or something. I'm sure it'll be around here somewhere. Pistol, iron. That's a rifle. Light bulb, belt, dice. I think it'd be better picking out uh, dice at this point, given how many times I've had to do it. Uh, that hat is the bonus item. This car is the other bonus item. Just grab myself a little more time just in case. And that weird nonsense is the other. I think that might have been a ceiling fan? Alright, uh, where were we? Iron. Golf ball. Ah, golf ball. Belt dice spider. Belt dice spider. Uh, huh. I guess the belt is going to be curled up or something? Weird. Because yeah, I don't have any line on this voltimeter either. Oh, there it is. Uh, belt dice spider, iron bow, whatever. Iron. Still no sign of the bow. That's a flower. Um, I mean, I would be fine if you put that on a package you were giving me, the flower, but uh, no. Spider! 
There's the bow. It was a black bow, which made it weirdly hard to find for me. Uh, pistol, belt, dice. Pistol, belt, dice. Pistol, belt, dice. Um, yeah, again, the dice are usually easier than this to track down. Uh, okay. There's the dice. They really were in plain view. I don't have an excuse for that one. Weird that a pistol would be this hard to find. Like, you'd think they would have, uh... It would size-wise... There's the belt. Alright, so we're just down to the pistol. We're one item away from being able to cheat our way through the rest of this level. Which... I'm gonna say is gonna feel pretty awesome when we do it. So let's just go back to the map. Let's go to one of the places where I still need to find two items. An acorn and a weight. Uh, acorn and weight. I found all those acorns in the other maps. You'd think this one would give me less trouble. But given the design of this, it could be hiding behind something. And I wouldn't know it. There it is. We're done. We're going home. Where's the weight, people? Oh, it was a dumbbell. Who knew? Yep. Uh, let's do summer. Lizard and camera. I'm going to take one last ten seconds to look for the lizard and the camera. Then we're just going to cheat our way through this. Uh, is it right down the side or something? I mean, no offense, but isn't a turtle technically a kind of lizard? I don't actually think that's true. I mean, I would have no way to know if it was. There's the camera. Ugh. It's a weird kind of camera. I'll take a hint now. Completely hidden behind some shrubs. Yep. That's, that's what this game thinks is playing fair. Just FYI. Phone! That's where we found the jumper seat or whatever it was. Uh, still no line on that phone. Alright, tell me where it was, game. We're all waiting with bated breath. Oh, God, I actually found that once before, and I thought it was cheating to call just that part a phone. And apparently, uh, yeah, that screwed me up pistol. I've already failed to find the pistol, so let's just not get it now. Uh, okay. Winter. Film or flim. And the answer is... Oh, it was a film reel. It's actually empty. That's an empty reel, guys. You can't expect it, like, you can't get away with calling that film. That's not film. Conspiracy. Nice. Hey, as long as it's not one of those cow-spiracies, I'm fine with it. Okay. I've gotten a lot better at this. Yay! One more C. And we're done. I'm not saying that's a waste of everybody's time. I'm just saying it feels like a waste of everybody's time. Do I have to do energy as well? No, that was it. Wait, did I only have to do two this time? Did it go back down? I feel like I only did match three in that. Weird. Alright, back to it. Staircase behind the door, the floor above me had been cut away, and the stairs rose up to a dorm on the next floor. Oh. I ran up the stairs and tried to turn the handle. Security lock. Not set, but something strange happened. What key? Anyway. A sequence of lights and sounds. Oh, like um, the Simon I've been playing. Stronger. Exact sequence. Yep, it's working in the thing. There's a terrible howl. Hearing screams. Wow. It's getting dark. We have to find every item. Do you see that? We have to find every every item in the level. Alright, we're going to do this level, but this is going to be the last level for the day. Uh, going to take a pass after this, take a, uh, a rest, come back to this fresh at a less insane time in the future. Knife, although that is a dagger. Uh, bone. Bone. Yeah, a bone could look like anything, guys. It's probably going to be like a, just an arm bone. Oh, no, it's one of those. Uh, balloon. Balloon should be easy. Unless it's one of those miniature balloons. Like, there's this uh, miniature balloon on a... Like, there's a picture of a kid on a sign. And the kid on the sign had a tiny balloon. And that was the way they hid the balloon. 
don't remember what game that was. It might have been the Demon Hunter? Anyway. Cheese Sword Thermometer. Thermometer. Sword. That was a sword. Last time I thought that was a sharpener, but it wasn't. The cheese, the gigantic ing cheese that was impossible to miss last time, yet still took me forever to find. Felt better to find it right away this time. I remember where the top was. That's something. Boots Balloon Stop Sign Frying Pan. Boots Balloon Frying Pan. Uh, there's the frying pan. It's on its side, making it more difficult to find. Wouldn't it be hilarious if the balloon was a deflated balloon, and that's why it was so hard to find? Uh, sewing machine is the bonus item, which is awesome. Uh, all right, I think we're going to call this and just uh, go do something else for a while. Oh, there are the boots. Yikes, you're actually making us find every item game. That is so not cool. Frog! I need a noose, which you'd think would be hanging from the ceiling, but no, it's hanging from the bike. Basketball. Can't be hard to find. Spade. Oh, no, wait. I remember what the spade was. It was straight up and down here. Yes. Do not enter sign. Yeah, thanks. Uh, map. Done. A bull's head. Oh, it's a bull's skull. But, you know, uh, beggars choosers. Cannon. Yep. Thermometer. Uh, yes. Bat is usually a baseball bat. In fact, I think it's been a baseball bat every time. Which is apparently, the, you know, that special kind of bat that's tiny compared to a woman's shoe. You know, maybe it's a giantess's shoe. Books. All right, we'll come back for the iron later. And uh, if we need more uh, time. Uh, hammer. Toy car. Hammer. I'm not forgetting the hammer again. You're not getting me twice, game. Where's the ore? You know, let's just do the match three. Then we'll come back to this. Oh, no, it's um, ribbon. Okay, so, let's stretch you out over here. You go over everything. You go under this one and this one, so let's put you up there. I think this is going to be safe. Um, Alright, so you cross here, here, and here. So if I put you down there, that should help a little. you there and you there, but how do I get you across here without causing huge problems for everyone? Damn it! No, wait! I think I got this. No, I don't. Ooh, I'm so bad at these. Glad there's not a time limit. You know what else there isn't? A reset button. Now look carefully. So this goes over that one. Alright. So this would have to go down here, screwing everything up. Come on, I'm, I'm touching something. There we go. Huh. Soccer ball. Lighter. No, those are matches. There's the iron. Wait, no, that's a... In my defense, I it's not that hard to mistake an anvil for an iron. Although the fact that I forgot that the iron was in the previous screen and not this one is less easier to explain. Uh, extinguisher, yep. Road cone, also yes. Lemon, it's right there. Saxophone was my bonus item last time, so I'm not going to forget where that was. Chess set should be right up here. Shuttlecock, uh, or birdie, would be right there. Banana lighter ore, so the banana should be easy to find because of its color, and it was. Banana lighter, oh, there's the ore. Alright, so we're going to take a, a pass on the ore for now. Come back for it later. Sorry, the lighter for now. Come back for it later. Just going to give a quick look to see if I can find it, which would make the trip back later much easier. Less chance of wasting a thing. But you know what? I can't. So uh, let's just skedaddle. Get to work in the next 12. Slippers. Yep. Two hats. That's hat one. And I want to say... I don't see a hat two. Huh. Oh, no. There it is. Apple. Yep. Pencils. Pencils. So like a pencil kit? Yes. Lantern. Yep. Coins. That I remember quite well. We've been to this screen a lot, is the thing. Earth. Hand is a hand print. Scissors are hanging on the wall for once. Pistol. Hey, another pistol I can't find. Great. Uh, no, there it is. A phone band-aid. 
Um, Band-Aid is right there. Do we have a line on the phone? Oh, yep, there it is. I should have gotten some extra time from this screen before doing that. That was silly of me. I was just so excited to actually be finished one. Uh, belt, I'm never going to forget where that was. Match three? Or is it, um... Yeah, it is match three. I have a, t a hard time remembering which is which. I'll say this for them. It's nice that the various screens have different hidden object puzzles that correspond to the themes of the screens. Like that is... That's a good bit of design. I've been very hard on these uh, match three puzzles, but I can't complain about everything. And specifically, this is them doing a good job. Uh, okay. Yes. Yes. Uh, okay. Perfect. Perfect. This is all going wonderfully. We're almost there. Uh, yep, yep. Yeah! Alright! That was much less painful than previous ones have been. Barbel, the number two. Bike, again. That says measure gauges. You realize the term measure gauges could be anything, right? Clock, barbell. Did I find a barbell here before, or is it just that I found a lot of barbells? Well, whether I found it or not, it was super easy. Lemon! Lemons are always very easy to find, because, you know, they st they, there's no way to make them not stand out from uh, the surrounding areas, except by using way more cheating than even this game is comfortable with. And this is a game that uses transparency cheating, the dirtiest type of cheating there is. Are those measure gauges? No. What is a measure gauge? You know what? Eventually I'm going to have to find out because this game requires me to find everything. This level, not this game. That's a dart. You're asking me for a dart. I'm clicking on a dart. Okay, so for everyone who's wondering why he's getting so frustrated, there's a dart sticking out of the board up here at the top above the one-away sign. I'm clicking on nothing is happening. There's a second dart here next to the ceiling fan looking thing, and that is the one I'm supposed to get. That's just shoddy craftsmanship, guys. Exit. If I find 11 more items, we can just hint our way through the rest of this. So please, wish me luck and help with good thoughts, because I want this level to be done. Although, you know, now that I say that, the next level is going to be more difficult. So, what, what's really the point of any of it? Finishing the game so you can save finish the game? Yeah, but that doesn't really impress people. Well, you have a certain amount of pride wrapped up in being a hidden object guru. Uh, excuse me, not a hidden object guru the hidden object guru. Okay, fine. But the point is, if you just bail on this game, you're going to be able to uh, saying that you can't beat hardcore, old-style hidden object games. And is that how you want to think of yourself? You made it through the Civil War game, which was demonstrably harder with this one, because it was just full of nonsense items and writing words and, you know, not enough hints and not a clear way to get more hints. Like... If you could beat that game, how hard can this one possibly be? You know what? You make a good point, me. I think I'm just going to wrap this one up. Thank you, you. Me. Alright, that got away from me. Uh, I hope it didn't scare you off, because it would have scared me off. And if you made it through that, uh, you'll enjoy joining me for the rest of this game. Which I'm about to stop for the day, because, you know, obviously. Uh, there's a lighter around here somewhere. There it is. Dart and roller. Oh my god, one more item and we're done. Dart. So what do you think they mean by roller? Like, it's not clear, is it? Oh, it's a paint roller. Miniature paint roller. Uh, Alright, so now let's just uh, collect these items that we didn't know where they were. So measure gauges. Let's find out what those are. That is a measure gauge. What the H... There's no way I could have known what that was. Lighter. Uh, I know what the lighter's supposed to look like. It's supposed to be gray and square and kind of on an angle. But I just don't see anything like that anywhere on this screen. So let's just uh, take a hint. 
That's a flashlight. You're talking about a flashlight, you son of a bitch. Sorry, I'm... I have been a little okay with you naming things different things for different times they appear. But if you've called one thing a lighter multiple times in a game, you can't then turn around and call something else a lighter and expect us to know to look for that. That's cheating. Simon says... In case you're wondering why I shut up while doing that, I don't want to risk jinxing myself by talking about how good I am at those things and just talk over it and uh, ruin my chance at actually finishing it now that I know you have a limited number of attempts. Balloon! This is the balloon I had such trouble finding earlier. Oh, excuse me. I have no excuse for yawning. It's not 3 a.m. the way it normally is with these games. Uh, so, is that a balloon? No, it's not a balloon. Alright, so let's just, uh, have the game tell us where the balloon is, then we're done. And we still have two hints left. It was a flat balloon. Oh my god. Like, wouldn't it be so funny if it'd be a flat balloon? It would be impossible to find. So, this level we had to do four of them. No, five of them to escape. Because we did, um, three search and we did that. Which one is that? We did match three, we did Simon, and we're about to do Word Machine, Energy, and Puzzle. So, is it bad that I can't remember what the other kind of uh, minigame is? It just shows you how good the minigames are in this. That like, they can't even stay in my head for more than a few minutes. Is this really enough time to get this done? Oh, no, okay. I guess so. Did not need that second U. And then I just screwed up. 14, 13, 12. I need an N and I need an E. That was closer than I would have liked it to be. But we're through. Alright, uh, two more. Let's do the puzzle, then we'll do the energy. At least the puzzle's not timed. Um... No? Huh. You know what? We'll come back to you. Um, I'm sorry, are they... Okay, that was confusing. I thought for a second there were two of that puzzle piece. That's obviously the bed. There we go. Uh, don't know what that gray nonsense is. But this is obviously the, the picture on the wall. I was about to say photograph, but it wasn't a photograph. All right, uh, this is more of that same picture. Uh, what else have we got? Come on, give me corner pieces, you jerk. That a kitty cat? It is. Go, kitty cat. Uh, live your ultimate dream of being a kitty cat in a video game. Uh, all right. Is that... Oh, it's the photo picture again. Spending a lot of time with that picture, aren't I? Alright, um... Huh. Is that a cat or a... Like, what's that dark? Oh, it's his jeans. Oh, that means you probably have to go here? Yeah. There we go. Uh. Okay. Yes. Um. No, not seeing that. Oh, yeah, there it is. And this would be down here? Yeah. All right. We're nearing the end of our journey. Our journey named Bernie. You know what? I didn't know what color that was, and that's why all the gray was confusing me. But now that I see what color it is, this is not going to be as hard as I thought it was going to be. 
Um, here? No. There we go. Uh, yes. Uh, okay. All right. Off we go. Uh, this should be about it. Yep, we're just closed. Now it's just busy work. This guy spends a lot of time in his hotel room. So I'm getting that vibe. There's the dudes leaned overhead. And, uh, yeah. Kitty cat. Can we please wrap this up? Three cats. Uh, no. No. Nope, there it is. Oh, thank God. Um, you here? Yeah. Uh, hmm. Is that the pillow again? That's the pillow again. I accidentally uh, went too far down, and they only go up. They go up when you pick them up. So yeah. Yeah, this would have been a difficult one to place early in the game. I'm gonna say that I wasn't a fool for having no luck at that one. Perfection and perfected. Let's do the energy bleep and get out of here. Oh my god. We have a full minute to do this in. And I need seven more. Done! Hey, there were a couple of triple swats. Alright, let's see what the next story segment is. Just saying 13 would have been a, a good place to wrap this up. So the room is only discernible when the lighting lit up his cold, empty face as his dark as black holes likely to consume everything around them. Yikes. The cat meowing from a distant corner of the room as if it was calling to me. Well, I think it probably was. Again, I gave it the trust it deserved after all it already done to help me and push my way through the terrible dark went to the other side of the room. There was a small opening in some sort in the wall and the cat and I crawled into. Though I didn't know where it led to. Uh, it didn't take more than a moment before I painstakingly aware that the door the cat had led me to was a garbage chute. A long and perilous fall to take with a large pile of refuse cushion in my fall outside. Once free of the hotel, I jumped to my feet and started running to my car where I left by the road that sign I had hit. The cat was hot on my heels, determined not to be left behind. Together we jumped inside. Is that it? As my feeling friend and I sped away, I looked into the rearview mirrors, astonished by what I saw. Lightning, uh, uh, was, lightning was lighting. Had lit up, but anyway... Miles around, allowing me to see the hotel has vanished. Next morning, I decided to check for X about the hotel the local library. There's a newspaper the covered accusations of occult activities against the priest, ending in his excommunication from the church. What? Been demolished rather quickly. Quick indeed. Damn. Okay, uh, that was Haunted Hotel. I didn't know we were actually going to finish it right now. Boom. Number one time. Thank you very much. Two hours and 29 minutes. I'll take five for that. You're not giving me five? Okay. Take that, genius. I did in a third of your time. Huh. All right. So um, that was uh, Haunted Hotel, the first one in the series. I've been a hidden object guru. As you can see, I find uh, traditional old style hidden object games somewhat painful to play, but... I was interested in the series because I liked both Charles Dexter Ward and the Axiom Butcher. I think next time in the series I'm going to go with a newer one. And I've already bought a newer one, The X. So that's probably what we're going to play unless uh, Big Fish Games give me more codes and sends me to another game. So we'll see. All right. Um, I've been the Hidden Object Guru. Thanks for making it to the end of the video with me. Uh, please like and subscribe. Uh, and, uh, what else? Oh yeah, uh, GC underscore Danny, if you want to follow me on, uh, Twitter and find out when I'm going to be doing, uh, live streams and various hidden object code giveaways. And I think that's it. Alright, so, um, 
thanks for playing, and I will see you uh, somewhere else at another game.